First tonight, a double shooting in Whitehaven happening in an area where you can find tens of thousands of tourists at any given time. Thanks for being with us tonight. I'm Shay Arthur. WREG's Jerita Patterson is live tonight where officers say that violent attack happened in Jerita. And this happened in the parking lot of a restaurant. No, oh, you're right. And Shay, you said it best. Here in the heart of Whitehaven, folks, is where we find tourists. We find visitors. They come, they take their travel photos. They also take plenty of videos, but police were after surveillance video at the restaurant just behind me. Saki versus tequila video that they are hoping will lead them to the person who pulled the trigger. Folks, let's walk you through exactly what we have learned. It was just moments ago. We spoke with a gentleman who identified himself as the assistant manager here at the restaurant. His name is Brandon. He goes on to tell us it was just after 10 o'clock when he heard a commotion in the parking lot. He steps out trying to de-escalate exactly what's happening. He said he actually saw someone leave the parking lot, turn on to Elvis Presley Boulevard, and then open fire. Sadly, two people were caught in the chaos. He told us those two people were taken to the hospital. Fortunately, they are expected to be okay. Brandon goes on to tell us they have done everything at this restaurant to deter to deter crime. They have security on the premises. They have multiple surveillance cameras. Sadly, violence still managed to make its way into this location. Take a listen. This is like the first time a shooting happens here. So don't think it's like, like it happens often. No, it's just like the first time it happened. Like our food, our drinks are good, everything. But you know, we just can't control what happened outside, you know, and at the end of the day, it's Memphis, you know. Now, sadly, he goes on to say, as you heard him say, it is Memphis. Uh, once more, Brandon really emphasized this happened outside the restaurant. Coming up, folks, uh, at 10 o'clock this evening, we're going to share with you what else police were able to get. They have surveillance video, but something else that could lead them to the person that pulled the trigger. In the meantime, if you know anything at all that could help detectives, the number to call, of course, Crime Stoppers at 528 Cash. Reporting for your news leader in Whitehaven, Jarita Patterson, WREG News. Channel 3. Say back to you. Looking for answers tonight, Rita. Thank you for that.